Gila. <laughs> Hello and welcome to a new series called Returning to Flight RC. I'm Trevor. I'm Stephen. And we're brothers. It's, uh, it's sort of, well, you, you could see we're it. brothers. Anyway, so basically, we haven't been flying for around about 15 years, maybe? Yeah. 15? It's not They've 20, is it? Could be 20. away in the attic. Um, a lot of these aircraft are ones that we've, we've had in the past, and a lot of them we've managed to secure and buy. Quite recently, some. Quite yeah, recently. Yeah. Um, obviously, a lot of them are old models, and that is the purpose of this series. We're basically going to take these old aircraft, we're going to strip them of their um, FM, FM kit, yeah. FM yeah. kit, and we're going to replace them with brushless motors or those that are IC. I mean, what's this thing? <laughs> He's a bit broke, but we're getting going. We're going to radio all of this kit up. We're going to get it up in the air and we're going to give old vintage, forgotten about, pre-loved, aircraft RC and get it in the air we got another beautiful day welcome to another episode sorry was you gonna say something there Stephen gorgeous weather gorgeous weather that's yeah, what again. I was gonna say yeah um, beautiful the only trouble with gorgeous weather we're on a runway as you as you know and um, we've got to keep an eye out however it's a private airstrip and we will get a phone call to say who's coming in or it will come up on the radio. What's that coming We have been warned that there could be one this afternoon, so uh, keep our eyes peeled. Which is very close to now, this afternoon. That's beautiful, isn't it? So we've got the coarse hair here today. Coarse hair? Not coarse hair. Coursing. Hair coursing. So here she is. What, what is it? I, I forget. I think it's 750, something like that. It's probably not even that. Um, this is, you may have seen one of my earlier videos, when I first got this, it, it was running on a brush um, motor, which was on a gear, and it was such a slow park flyer, great, but any sort of wind, you just did not have the power to get out of it. It's not direct drive, it's on a little gear, so I'll just spin it up and you can, it's quite underpowered, but I'll spin it up and you can... A little puff of wind and it's off. Um, I've crashed it many a times, I've glued it together. So now I've glued it together. Now I've put um, a 30 amp speed controller. You won't see it in there, that's just where the battery goes. So I've got a 1400 kilowatt motor on there, which is the same as on the Terrasaur. Um, this is a nine inch prop. I've got some sacrificial wheels that I've put on the bottom on Velcro um, because we can belly land here. However, the prop's going to snap. So I, I'm hoping the wheels will save the prop and they'll rip off and the prop, and then all I've got to do is put them back on. So what I'm running is a 35C 900, so I've got nice bursts of about 70C. Um, it's 4.7, um, obviously it's a two cell, so it's 4.7 volts. Now, this is good. I think the old one was good for about eight minutes. You get a fair amount of time. I'm gonna this run this. A light aircraft. I'm gonna run this for hopefully eight minutes without catastrophic Injury. Let's get it together, get it up in the air. And let's get it going. Right, stop the tape. Stop the tape? Yeah. Is that what they call it? Tape? Yeah. <laughs> stop the tape. No more important safety rule than to check whether it's actually got bolts in it. So how much power do you have there then? 87, that can't be right. I'm sure I put... It says 87, doesn't it? Why is that 87? Well, because it's not 100%. 
Let's do a four minute flight. Yeah. It'll do eight. Let's do four minutes. Four minutes. Four minutes. Um, and see what we got. Can only go crash, can't it? You won't crash. You can glide it in. Yeah. Okay. Nice still so day. You can. The CFG is round about in line with the wheels. Roughly put that on there. There we are. Lovely. Yeah, then we're going to turn the radio on. We're on course here. Let's plug it in and get some noises. Wind's coming behind us now. It's all over the place. Isn't it? What's that mean? I don't like that. Yeah. So that's what it was. We needed a reset, um, recalibrate the um, speed controller. I will take them actually, because it's that sun is getting a bit low. Right, so let's get it back on. And it's getting chillier. Wind's picking up a little bit. Which is perfect for this. That's it, it's really calibrating now. Perfect for this plane. You like wind. <laughs> right, let's just pop that cap on there. Clunk click every trip. Right, checking right aileron, left aileron. Elevation. Look, can you see? Look, I've just put surgical tape on there. The surgery. Right, that needs pulling over. This is why you do your pre-flight checks, you see, because that was out. Wants to go, doesn't it? Right, you, so this you, has got a 1400. So you could that probably take should. off from the table. Yeah, probably. Right, let me get into position. Oh, I've got hold of it wrong. It's a because it's a. Um, a low wing, yes. you can launch it like this. Yeah. Where's exactly. that wing coming from? Into our faces again. Oh! <laughs> it's up. There's a bit of wind, you know. I can't see you. I'll let you get control for a minute. Uh, Where are you? I can't see it. Well. It's a bit of a dot in the sky at the I'm moment. I'm bringing down a bit. Yeah. It's, it's this wind, isn't it? Uh, you're so fast with this thing. I'm not. I can't even see it. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bit. Is that you or the radio? No, Could... I need to bring it in. I need to bring it in. I need to bring it in. It's, it's tail heavy. I've got to. Just bring it in on the wind. Whoop. Well done. Right. Perfect, yeah, yeah, perfect. <laughs> perfect. I've got to get, well, get that battery forward. Any landing that doesn't break anything is a good landing. Hasn't it broken though? No. Do you think that's alright? Yeah, it just hopped on the grass. Right, let's get that battery forward. Right, battery forward. Just check it. I'm going to check it. See if right, See if she is, see if she is. It's windy, you can hear it. I mean, it's difficult. What about... It's um, sort of on it, it's sort of on it. What about upside Should down? Should I take the wheels off? No, let's keep the wheels on, because that saved it just then. Right. Right, batteries forward. Right, are you going to change your hand position? Or are you happy like oh, that? No, no, no. Oh, we might have someone coming in. Might get a flyby. Oh, no, he's not flying, right. Ready? Mr. T, can you fly that way, please? Not into the sun. Look at it climb. <laughs> it just wants up. That's where it wants to be. What's it like now? Now you've moved the battery. Just needed a bit more, I think. Are you getting any of that? Yeah. It's very high, isn't it? 
it is high. And of course the colour against the sky. I know, but because it it flips around so much, you don't want to be too low, do you? <laughs> Remember the wind pushing down. Whoop, lovely. It is just pop. I wasn't trying to land it, I was trying to recover. I know, but the wind is pushing down on top of it. Right, let's go and get it again. Pause the tape. I will pause. Pause for thought. The long walk of shame. <laughs> Take the wheels off. Um, and we'll give that a go. It's way, it's like a fly in the sky. I can't see it. Are you going to fall too? Not yet. Hit number two on the zoom. Ooh. <laughs> it just, just does its own thing. A bit of wind hits it and that's Whoa. it. Well, it's light as a feather, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, we're getting about nine. Like the Battle of Britain. It is a battle, to be fair. Oh. It's hit, set away, and it's gone. I'm zoomed out a bit because you can't really see what it's doing if you have it too close because um <laughs> it's just a little bit too windy Try being on the video side of it. That was even closer. <laughs> What can I say? <laughs> I crashed it. <laughs> Probably trying something that I shouldn't try in the wind, uh, considering we haven't really flown for years. But there we are. That's what it's about. Excuses, excuses. Ha, ha, ha.
oops, pick the bits up. That really is the walk of shame. Oh, it's good fun though, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah, it's great fun. What's happened? Well, I broke the prop. Uh, the cowling smashed right in. Um, no wing damage, no tail, nothing. Um, yeah, it should be fine. Put another prop on, straighten out the cowling. Let's go and see what um, voltage is left in that battery. Battery's gone all the way forward. It might be damaged. Well, it came in pretty. Yeah, it did come in. Heavy. No, that's Nose fine. heavy. Some plug in. Turn it off. What you got left? Well, we had some good flight, so. 34. So there we are. So we're looking about seven, eight minutes. Go for seven. I'll record it at seven and hopefully, if you can keep it in the air for seven minutes, that'd be great. <laughs> but come on, it was a bit windy. You, you can't see, you just cannot see the wind through the camera. Um, the sock is just out of the tree and it's got seven. Sock up. You're not in zooming. Yeah, it's a bit of wind. Enough to lift the sock. And with that little plane, it doesn't really need wind. Yeah. Well, there you go. You win some, you lose some. Didn't lose a lot, um, but this plane is a, a little park flyer. Um, however, it's probably designed to be flown by someone that can fly them. <laughs> <laughs> No, it's light as a feather, doesn't it, need any wind no at wind. all. Uh, the motor is dropped right forward, so I'm going to make up a new uh, motor mount um, and get it back up and together. However, this is what it's about, and it's about not throwing away your old toys, aircraft, your old models. Don't throw them away. Fix them up. Fix get, them up. Get them flying. Get them up to date with uh, up-to-date electrics, speed controllers, and, but it's so cheap now to, to get a brushless setup. Um, so get them back out, get them flying. Uh, as I'm sure we're all aware with this COVID situation, you've, you've, you've just got to get out and do something different. So that's it for this episode. Um, see you on the next one thank you again for all the subscribers click the link below and you'll see the next video or if you subscribed it should run in sequence so keep up with that um, got something interesting coming up in the next episode um, so I'm not sure when we can shoot that the next fine day. Next fine day. It's all about the weather really, isn't it? So, thanks for watching. See you again. That's it, isn't it? I think we're done. Hang on, let's, let's put, put this on the end. <laughs>